with my love Like a castle in the sun, no one comes down It comes tumbling to the ground when she speaks It's a dangerous fantasy, sets me free It's where I want to be She sets me free And her hair glows like a lighter in the wind And I lose my senses, baby She gets under my skin when she speaks She's all I'll ever need, she sets me free Oh oh, to where I wanna be, I wanna be We are in Virginia now. I think we have about six hours left. Exactly six hours or maybe like five hours and like 50 minutes or something. So yeah, we're almost there. We're about to get Taco Bell because I'm hungry. And the reason we're gonna eat at Taco Bell is because it is 9.26 and that's the only place selling lunch at this time, so yeah. When she speaks It's a dangerous fantasy Sets me free it's Where I want to be She sets me free Where I want to be Want to be She sets me free week it rained non-stop and Jersey was having like a hundred degree weather oh crap the water's coming closer the Sun the Sun is out really And her hair glows like a lighter in the wind 
then I lose my senses, baby Gets under my skin when she speaks She's all I'll ever need, she sets me free Oh oh, to where I wanna be, I wanna be Forever 21 along with the pants and I'm pretty sure the belt is Target and then the shoes are actually Old Navy so yeah I don't know if you can see them and then the purse is Forever 21 also and then makeup I didn't really do much on the eyes I just did falsies these are Goddess by Coco and on the lip is Kylie Jenner Court K with literally lip gloss on top. Yeah. Look at that highlight though. Your highlight ain't fleek unless you can see it in the dark. How far does this okay. is? What, the actual place? Yep. 20 minutes. Okay, so we are at the beach and the pool all day today. And now we are headed to a boardwalk called Broadway at the Beach. It's about 18 minutes away now, so we just left. And we're gonna go to an aquarium and Ripley's Believe It or Not and eat dinner over there. So this is our first full day here. I didn't vlog yesterday a lot, except on the way here because pretty late and then we just went to dinner and food shopping. And then I vlogged a little bit today at the beach, but not too much because I didn't want my camera getting all wet but I'll try to vlog more tonight at the boardwalk and also tomorrow, whatever we decide to do. So yeah.
So I've been vlogging this whole entire trip, but um, I haven't really been talking a lot. And it's only because we've been doing so many activities because we only have been here. Like our vacation is only five days, but two of those days are the days of arrival and the days of leaving. So we got here, uh, we got here on Friday. Um, hold on, let me turn this off. I decided that I would just sit here and catch you guys up a little bit since most of the footage is just going to be like different things. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, so like I said, Friday we got here. And Friday was more of just grocery shopping for the room because I will be doing a room tour. I will be doing a room tour. I'm just waiting for um, the service to come clean it because it's a mess right now and I really don't want to show you guys a messy room. So I will be showing you guys the little suite that we got um, later tonight after they come. I know. So Friday we went grocery shopping for the room, we went to eat, and then we literally came back here and passed out. We were so tired because from New Jersey to South Carolina Myrtle Beach, it's 10 hours. And it took us a little bit over 10 hours because we stopped at J. Cole's house, 2014 Forest Hills Drive in Fayetteville, North Carolina. So that was such a great experience because me and my boyfriend are just huge fans of him as you guys already know from past videos I told you guys that I'm in love with him so seeing that was just so surreal and I was so excited it was a great experience so we stopped there so it was a little bit over 10 hours so it was a really long day for us so once we got here we just wanted to pass out and then Saturday we went to the beach and pool in the morning and we stayed there until about I want to say 3 we came back to the room showered i did my makeup got dressed and then we headed over to ripley's believe it or not aquarium that was such a great experience which you guys saw earlier that was just so much fun and then after that we walked around the boardwalk that was there and we got something to eat at senor frogs what else and then we came back here and just chilled because once again we were so tired we woke up at like seven for breakfast on the beach so this is pretty much just like a recap since I said I haven't been doing a lot of talking. This is just a recap of everything you saw in the previous um, clips before this. Um, and then yesterday was Sunday and we got up super early, went to the beach super early, only for like an hour and a half. And then we came back to the room, got dressed and showered and everything. And then we headed out to um, Alligator Adventure, which you guys also saw the clips from that. It was pretty much just um, a whole bunch of alligators and different animals. And you got to like touch them and everything it was so much fun. And then after that we headed straight to mini golf, which was 20 minutes away. Myrtle Beach is huge. I, I used to come here all the time as a kid, but I never remembered how big it truly was. Like it's huge. Going from North Myrtle Beach, South Myrtle Beach, Central Myrtle Beach, it's just from our hotel in North Myrtle Beach to Central Myrtle Beach where the mini golf was, it took us about 22 minutes. Like it's huge. So yeah, so we went over there and we did mini golf and Ripley's, believe it or not, auditorium, which you guys also saw the clips for the auditorium. I didn't take video mini golfing. I will, at the end of this video, include some clips from my Snapchat of like pictures and Snapchat videos I took of us where I couldn't bring out my camera because it was just too much. But yeah, so we did that and then we came back to the room, ordered pizza and just relax for the rest of the night. My so our plan right now is we just got in from breakfast. It is, let me see what time it is. It's 10.53 right now. We just got in from breakfast about half hour ago. My boyfriend's showering now. I just got out of the shower. I got on my bathing suit, as you can see under here. Got on my bathing suit. And we are going to head out to the beach in the pool. into the room and then off to the right hand side this is the bathroom it's a little bit of a mess right now 
a double sink, shower here. Okay, and then you walk out, and off on this door right here is the bedroom. And then the closet's over there. And then the TV. And then. Wait, which one? And then you walk down this hallway. And then they have like a cute little vase thing here. Oh, wait, did I just turn it off? Where's the light for here? And then here is the little sitting area. You can have your meals here, and then that just goes into the bedroom. You can look out, but that's just a little sitting area. And then you have the couch here with the table, TV over here, full kitchen. I don't know why it's not focusing. Refrigerator. This over here. And you come out here, and they have the sliding glass door, and you are on the balcony. They give you two chairs and a little footrest, and then this is the view we had. This is the resort that we stayed at. That is our room. I will list all the details in the description box below about the resort, where we stayed, the name of it, all that. So if you guys are looking into coming to Myrtle Beach on vacation, you guys can look this place up, and I highly recommend it. It was really good. Um, I would definitely come back here and stay here. It's just a really good environment and there's so much to do in just this area. So really, really loved it. So yeah, so that was the room. One more with the view because I can't get enough of it. It's just gorgeous. So yeah. And then I will have my outfit details on this outfit right here on my blog. So I will leave a link to that down below also. Baby, 